And now, some exciting news for Medibank customers. Medibank Private is going public. With your data, unfortunately. So, on behalf of everyone here at Medibank, we apologise for this latest hack. That said, we are excited to announce our new range of premium apologies with optional extras such as grovelling, hand wringing, and barely reassuring corporate speak. No matter which level of apology you choose, the good news is that this increased access to your personal data comes at no extra charge. Though we did think about it. Plus, we've managed to contain the hack so that it only affects 4 million people. Or, to put it another way, one in one of our customers. And if you used to be a customer of Medibank but left, well, we don't want you to feel left out. You also might be affected. So, what do you need to do? Well, nothing. What do we need to do? We don't know. Now, many are wondering just how all our customers' personal data could have been exposed. Well, we want to assure you that our sophisticated cybersecurity team is asking Jeeves everything he knows. Any luck? Nothing yet. Maybe try Bing? Cybersecurity Minister Claire O'Neill has labelled this data breach a dog act. But according to our experts, there is simply no way a dog could have pulled this hack off, right? That's what Bing's telling me. But if it wasn't a dog, and we're pretty sure it wasn't, then who else would have the motive? Well, we're not pointing the finger at Amy Insurance, but we are hoping to interrogate these two individuals. But what are we doing to help? Well, for starters, we're no longer pushing ahead with our premium increases. Until January 2023. Aren't we generous? Because let's face it, you should be paying extra for this kind of service. But regardless of what's happened, we can't stress enough the importance of having insurance. It's a lesson we learned the hard way. It may have surprised you to learn from our announcement that Medibank does not have cyber insurance. But in our defence, we don't have insurance because, you know, you pay all this money for peace of mind and then like, your data gets hacked and you're like, why am I even paying for this? And you know, It's just not worth it, is it? Medibank.